All right, Michael Schrader here at Dally's Ozark Fly Fisher. Um, I want to introduce you to the new Orvis H3. Uh, this rod was quite a rage this year at the IFTD iCast show. It's changed up a little bit. The Orvis Helios comes in the 3F and the 3D. The, the, there's no more mid flex and tip flex. The 3F is finesse and that's your mid flex. The 3D is the distance and that's your tip flex. Um, tip flex meaning this is going to be a faster rod. This is going to be your streamer rod. This is going to be your your hopper rod. This is going to be that rod that you're going to use when you're throwing a bigger fly. The 3F is the finesse rod. This is the rod that you're going to want for your dry flies and for your midging, especially on the low water conditions. Aesthetically, um, you can see they've, they've got the white down here close to the handle. This, is, this helps identify the rod better when it's in the boat. Orbis markets this as having a reinforced blank. That reinforced blank adds strength to these rods and what that does is that reduces the ovalizing. That is, if you think about the blank being a circle, when that flexes, it does not compress like the shape of an egg. It stays more round. Basically, when you're casting it, it doesn't vibrate as much, causing the line to fly truer. How that helps the average caster? And again, accuracy depends upon the person that's actually casting the rod. Um, having a more accurate rod, having that vibration dampened, that means this rod is not going to work against you when you cast it. What we have in stock currently are both the five weights in the 3F and the 3D. Eight weights on its way as well. The rest of the weights will start coming in in November and continue on into the March. Orvis is gonna release different weights at different times. 